Um, this game is inspired by Super Monkey Ball. I don't know whether you have played uh -huh. on it. So, um, Ready? Yeah. But instead of a ball, we had a real car. A car with like, real physics in it. Oh. But there's still one problem with, within it. It's kind of annoying. Okay, This is an acceleration and this is a steering. Mm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. that's cool. But it's a bit complicated. Yeah. <laughs> the, the problem with this is because each wheel will exhibit its own torque. Torque. Uh, yeah. So, um, so um, sometimes it, it will be quite unbalanced because um, the hand positions are quite different and it will flip. I tried, I tried to mitigate it by using, by attaching a weight so that it will, I can lower the center of gravity. But, well, it did some, some job, but it wasn't perfect. And I think that this would work perfectly if the terrain was like the terrain that you will have in a car. You know, it's, it's obviously the physical where we thought, you know, where we considered. Yeah, this is like driving on a moon in a Ferrari. Exactly. exactly. <laughs> and this is because when I was doing the level design and testing, I was still thinking about the ball. Yeah. If this was a ball ro rolling down, it would be cute. It would be like pinball. Mm -hmm. uh, and so what I need to do next you know, to improve <laughs> this is I need to change the level design and make it just a track, just a track. Right? Oh, that's it flipping there. Yeah. Uh -huh. It's flipping too much. <laughs> well, that's because that's what the, le the, the level is pushing it. That's like exactly what's happening. The level is made. Oh, so is there also a force from behind on it? No, it's no. just that the level is all con it's all uh, concave uh -huh. or convex. How do you say that? Yeah. Okay. It's all concrete. It's like the, the, the level is made so that the, the ball will like roll and do this, uh. and half pipes and holes and things like that. <laughs> but a car has four kind of balls that go in single track, right? And it's possible with a car. There's this game called Track Media. <laughs> yeah. You could have like before all of this where you spend hours and hours designing your amazing Ferrari, but then the track is set up for like a ball. So your car just like things around. That's, that's like, that's the result. <laughs> yeah, that's, 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 that's. Oh, 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 oh. he's kidding someone. Okay. <laughs> 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 So yeah, that's that, that, that's probably the, the biggest problem we have because this level is designed for a ball, not a car. <laughs> so um, if you if you can, if you want to see the level that we did, <laughs> we divided the labor and everybody went home and it was like, okay, I had, I guess I need to do a level, and then I did a level, but I had a ball to test it. I didn't have the car because the car was being worked on at the time. I actually started a completely new level that is like re almost ready to go, but it's for cars, which means that there's no big ramps and falls and so on and so forth. <laughs> that sh the, the shape it has is like, it's like a bowl. You put a, a marble inside it and it does this. <laughs> it's cute, I mean, it's cute. Yeah. How did you create that giant level? Blender. And blender. And bl okay, so it's a three-dimensional object that just has a rigid body attached to it. Yeah, it's just a, a mesh rigid, rigid body. Oh, wow. Which, you know, that's a, that's a good discovery too, because apparently there is a, um, a limit in polygons to what a mesh rigid body can have. But also if, if it's too low resolution, the, the physics don't work. Sorry. You know, like the edges are too, too sharp. Mm. So I'm assuming that if there's like the need to create a beautiful track, a lot of the objects that are the actual terrain, they need to be very low resolution and then there needs to be a very fancy mesh on top of it hiding it. Which yeah. sounds obvious now, but you know but the time. Amusingly if you if you if you place place this track in, in a very high resolution one, it also does not work. It gets like really jittery. So I took this online just to test my car. And <laughs> if I go forward it will go crazy. Like the camera will, will go crazy. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> so yeah it it doesn't really work. Are you able to move it right? No, I was using the keyboard. Okay. Oh. I'm using a different screen for this. But you see, this wow. is more like it should be that the level, the range should be more like this. Yeah. <laughs> Not like super monkey ball.